We were contributing to the coping of the corona pandemic with mathematical models predicting the further development of uh, the pandemic. Um, our major contribution is that we elevated the seeming contradiction between the interests of economy and health and we showed that actually both have the same interest, namely to bring down the numbers as quickly as possible and to follow a mitigation strategy that is leading to low incidences. During the pandemic, we investigated a major outbreak in a meat processing facility in Germany. And this was one of the largest outbreaks last summer. And we could show that the SARS coronavirus 2 can be transmitted via very long distances among the workers. And this was a very important finding because it showed that the virus is transmitted via aerosols. And that was teaching us a lot how we can better protect people from infections. In our epidemiology department, we have responded to the pandemic in four major research areas. First, the seroprevalence study in multiple cities for multiple time points that helps observing the development. Second, that we have developed a multiplex antibody test together with colleagues in Reutlingen that allows differentiation between people naturally infected by the virus and people protected by the vaccine. The third area is the area of evidence synthesis, in which we collect all the body of evidence that is available on a certain question, we analyze it and turn it into a recommendation for the decision makers. And the fourth area is the area of digital health. We have developed multiple tools to support the monitoring of health staff, to support the symptom process in contact persons, but also especially SORMAS, the system to help the health department to do the contact tracing, to do the containment measures necessary to control the outbreak.